to Nicole's 120 <laughs> subscribers. My name is Bridget. I'm mostly behind the camera, but I've been coming out a little bit more. Today, I'm here with my friend Courtney. Hi. Courtney and I go so far back. We met through Savable Rescue. We have dogs. We like dogs. I invited her to come on the show because Similar to my fashion, I'm pretty much a jeans hoodie rescue t-shirt girl and sometimes we really got to push ourselves and go out on something besides rescue t-shirts. <laughs> <laughs> Being that your style is pretty simple, pretty casual, what if you have a box full of dresses and we have to play dress up? I probably wouldn't. Well, I would, but I would be very angry the entire time. Somebody likes purses. I do. Got a purse. Zoom in on it a little bit. All right, so it looks like we have, as the Brits would call it, a sexy little roll neck. Sleeves. Elbow patches. Super soft and cozy. Fall. In case you fall. <laughs> that's this. Oh, that's kind of cute too. So just a soft little Feels tunic. Cashmere. Cashmere. <laughs> this is a coat. It's a French jacket. It's a French jacket. That is really French. cute little tie on it. I love this neck. So this is more of jeans by Democracy. Every person who's been on the show that got Democracy jeans kept their Democracy jeans. We're back with the first two items in Courtney's box. On top, we've got the T-Berry and Weave. It's called a Cassia Color Block. Cute little tunic length with a little scalloped hem on the side there. I did just notice that it has this really nice banding seam here. You can turn around for us. And so the striping continues throughout the back. It's super soft to the top. Yes. Tell us what you think about it. I like it. I like the colors. It makes my chest actually look like I have a chest somewhat. And it's not tight. Mm -hmm. It's pretty loose. It's very soft. Mm -hmm. The arms are a little long, mm -hmm. but I like long arms. Yeah. And then the pants, these are by Democracy, our guest's favorite brand. This is called the Natalie Straight Leg Jean. It's in a dark wash indigo. I like them. Mm -hmm. They're not super long, which normally jeans are way too long for me. Mm -hmm. They fit on my waist okay. area, which normally they're always way too low because okay. my butt's too big. <laughs> so they don't ever go over my butt. Okay. So it's nice that they actually mm -hmm. go over. And they're soft. Mm -hmm. I like the color. I like the fit too. Okay. I like how high they go up. Mm -hmm. And this isn't a mid or a high rise. This is just their their traditional cuts. Like I said, everybody who gets a pair of Macrosy jeans, they just fall in love with them. We're back and Courtney is modeling a few more pieces from her first box. We've got this adorable black and white plaid, kind of a modern take on a peacoat trench. It's got this adorable, it looks like it's a diagonal zipper, and so it's off cast at the side and it's belted. Feels like it's not super heavy, but it's still warm. Like it feels like it's a, a good thickness to it. What do you think about the jacket? I want to snuggle up with a cup of coffee and read a book. Okay. It's very comfortable. I would have never picked this, but <laughs> I, I really like it. Uh-huh. Yeah. I haven't looked at it on myself yet, really, mm -hmm. but I, it feels comfortable. Yeah. Like I feel fancy. Fancy! Pinky's out! <laughs> Uh, your stylist had suggested uh, grabbing your clutch slash side strap. The purse does have multiple options. You can do like a side harness with it. The material, I mean it's leather, but it's like, what is this called? Pebble. That's, that's what I was going for. And it's in gold accents. It's got a lining to it. Yeah. However, I think when you put a light liner in a purse, it's just throw it's the purse good. away. It's going to be filthy in a week. I have a lot of purses. Patrick's going to be building me a purse closet. And these aren't like Target clearance purses. No. Uh -huh. I have Louis, I have Gucci, I have Fendi. That's uh -huh. where my extra money goes. Okay. So being the purse, not snob, but aficionado. Thoughts on this purse? No. I don't like the fabric. I don't like the gold. The color, I'm not a huge fan of. Mm -hmm. I like more classic style purses. Okay. Well, I would suggest that you let your stylist know not to send you more purses. I feel like I should be. <laughs> Do it! <laughs> this is the Market in Spruce, which is a Stitch Fix staple brand. So automatically I know that you're going to say it's soft. 
It's very soft because that's, that's like the main thing with them. Then the second thing I think you're going to say is, I think I'm going to pit out because it doesn't breathe. It does not breathe. I mean, <laughs> I think this has a lot of potential. I like the neck, mm -hmm. actually, because it's not, it, at first I was a little nervous because I, sometimes I get too mm -hmm. claustrophobic with anything around my neck, mm -hmm. but it's nice and loose. Yeah. And the arms feel a little tight. Okay. But it was very comfortable under the jacket. Oh, okay. We're back, and if you stuck around, then you know what the next segment is. Bag it or untag it. Again, this was by Coffee Shop. I've now seen two coats by this label that I absolutely love. Is this something that we're going to put in the bag? Or we're keeping it. We're keeping it. Next up, this is by Urban Expressions. It's the gray multi-compartmental purse. We're gonna bag it. Oh, I would not. Oh, all right. This is the. Tea berry and weed. Parting thoughts, keep it. I'm gonna okay. keep it. I'm gonna take it. We're gonna keep it. Excellent. All right, then we have the um, market and spruce, the cowl neck. Bag it or untag it? We're bagging it. We're gonna bag it. Last stuff, them jeans. I wanna keep them. Uh huh. But I think I'm, I haven't spent more than like $6.99 on a pair of jeans in a long time. <laughs> You're gonna keep up. Okay. So, what were your thoughts on having a complete stranger having a little bit of data about you and being able to produce at least three pieces that you like? I'm very surprised mm -hmm. because I generally don't like stuff. So, that being said, would you consider mm -hmm. another box in the future? Absolutely. Yep. Well, I'm excited that it worked for you. Thank you for sticking with us for another episode. If you like what you see, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share our videos, and uh, we hope to see you in the next one. Good boy. Mom. So we're going with the dog on the lap again? <laughs> it's getting we're real informal all of a sudden. <laughs> there, I can get done. You want to see? Most energetic dog you've ever met in your life.